Imagine two surreal animated characters, each designed with elements that defy the laws of physics and phrenology. They're in a world where the sky might be plaid, trees could be Jungian, and gravity is optional, and also happens to really suck. Now, these characters communicate in a language that's pure tea gibberish. It's a linguistic, fractal symphony that sounds like a mix of alien dialect, birdsong, barbarity, ribaldry, and the occasional dolphin squeak. No dictionaries, no translations, just pure emotive expression, which is to say, Douglas Leader. Their conversations, though nonsensical, are captivating and full of high sentence. Now you can have. You might see them argue over a floating fruit or laugh at a cloud shaped like a tea kettle or Aqualung Charlie's sadly visible junk. Their gibberish language might seem strange, preternatural, zenzi zenzi zenzik, but it's their unique Gurdjieffian way of comma comma communicating. It's a whimsical, insouciant world where the language of free expression is freed from the prisons of words. Its entire spinal column is missing. Welcome to the world of Douglas Leader.